as a basic check on my solution, I want to see how the deformed shape as well as the maximum deformation changes uh, when I refine the mesh. And I can do this within this project. So I could go into mesh, um, expand mesh in the tree, and change the face sizing. So, you know, decrease the element size, and that'll give me a more refined mesh. That'd be one way to do it. What I'm going to do instead is to create a copy of this project and refine the mesh in the copy so that I have both the original mesh result as well as a refined mesh result. So to do that, um, close mechanical, and that'll put you back in the project page, or you may need to select the you know, select the project page by clicking on this icon and right click on model and say duplicate. And twiddle your thumbs while Ansys creates a copy of the model that we already have. And note that um, the engineering data and geometry are shared. So if I need to change the geometry, I need to do it over here. And that will propagate through to this one. And let me rename this. So I'll call this 2db refined mesh. And then click anywhere outside that box. And so let me start mechanical by clicking on setup. Okay, um, so it has, you know, everything from the original project and um, what I need to do is change the mesh. So I'll go on the face sizing and if you recall, this length is eight inches. So let me do 10 divisions along this length. So I'll change the element size to, uh, so I'll say equal to eight divided by 10. So eight is the length of the edge and 10 is the number of divisions that we want. So each element edge along there will be 0.8 inches and I'll click on update to get the updated mesh and if I click on mesh in the tree I'll see the refined mesh and so I have a much much more refined mesh than before and to redo the solution on the refined mesh I just say solve and if I go and now look at the total deformation so this is 2db refined mesh, and so it's it's redone. You know, this is what we had before, but except that it's redone it on a refined mesh, and I can double check that by saying show mesh. I guess this doesn't show up here, um, but I I noticed that you know the the maximum deformation has changed um, by at least. Um, the third significant digit. So I'll have to do at least one more level of mesh refinement.